Hello again everyone. As you can see I uh, did some rabbit hunting today. I just went out for about 15 minutes and I got these three here. I uh, could have got a fourth one and got my limit but he was just a little bit small. Uh, I mean these they're, they're a decent size I guess. They're not monsters but they'll be pretty good. I shot them with my uh, my old single shot Ithaca 20 gauge. It's a, probably can't read that. M66 super single 20 gauge 3 inch chamber. Uh, you know, just an old single shot Ithaca. It's got a real nice and tight barrel on it. So it keeps the shot nice and tight and you get a little more distance that way. Which, so it's a good, it's a good old shotgun. Just an old single shot. The uh, shell I was using is, these are uh, Remington pheasant loads. Um, I like to use the high brass because again, coupled with the long and uh, tight uh, choke, with a tighter choke, you know, I think it's a uh, full choke in this thing. It, it doesn't have a interchangeable choke, but I think the uh, end of the barrel is like a full choke, I guess you could say. But Anyways, whenever you use these high brass, you get a more distance, so. Also, another thing is, I, you know, I shoot, I, I, I tend to shoot my rabbits a little bit farther distances than most people do. Um, and uh, so with the longer distance, you want to probably use a high brass, just so then you make sure you kill it. You know, because rabbit hunting, it's in the brush and they're running. So you kind of just get a quick second to take a shot, so you want to make sure that it counts and that it kills it and it doesn't feel anything. But these are just two and three quarter inch, uh, one ounce shot, and they're five shots. So, decent sized, it, it's, it's a pretty good rabbit load. Meant for pheasants, but it, it does a number on the rabbits. It, it, it's pretty good. So anyways, I'm going to skin these guys and gut them up and... Um, I might do a little cooking video for you. I got a recipe. It's called buttermilk fried rabbit. Looks pretty good. I might do a little cooking video for you guys. So, anyways, thanks for watching. Have a good one.